So today I have been recommended a wine to review from NZ Wine Addict. You should check out his profile on Instagram. This is the Ripon Mature Vine Riesling 2018 Lake Wanaka, Central Otago, South Island, New Zealand. Um, I don't know much about the 2018 vintage. In fact, I don't know anything about the 2018 vintage in New Zealand. So if anyone knows whether that was a good vintage or a bad vintage, please do leave something in the comments. I think, um, you know, the best thing about Ries uh, Riesling, the best thing about Instagram is that, um, you know, we're all one big community and I can we can do things like this, share recommendations and try wines that we probably never have tried before. So um, please do uh, leave me your recommendations for other wines to try and tell me all about 2018 in Central Otago. I just don't know. This is the highest rated wine from a critic that I've actually reviewed on Instagram TV, IGTV. Uh, 96 points from James Suckling. Um, and he says, a thing of beauty, brimming with ripe lemon and pastry-like savoury nuances. Stony and fruity, brimming with freshness. Something indeed, 96 points, okay. Um, Rip on themselves, a very interesting producer. What usually, well, in years ago, I suppose, when you used to choose New Zealand wines, it was very much all about the producer rather than the the, the terroir or you know the the uh, appellation. But um, he, in particular, is very much into um, expressing the terroir. He's an organic and biodynamic producer, and he likes to get um, those mineral notes into his wines. Uh, let's see what this is like. The colour. That's one of the deepest wines we've had on uh, this series as well. It's a deep lemon. The nose, well, I'm swirling the glass. Here you can see it. And I can smell it from a foot away. So I can definitely say the wine is pronounced. It's extremely honeyed. Um, you, you get the impression this is gonna be a really sweet wine. There's um, notes of uh, the peel of a, like a clementine and very, there's always there's this kind of oily, rich note that if it was a German Riesling, you would say, oh, you know, it's like petrol, but actually it's more like lemon oil. It's, I don't know, it's very unctuous. Um, really makes you want to drink it, so I think I should do that. And the wine has a really great texture. It is very fresh. There are mineral notes in there but I, for me it does continue on with a kind of honey um orange peel kind of it's quite linear from the nose to the to the palate um the finish um goes on now it's a little bit green on the finish actually i wasn't expecting that and it's not sweet i don't even think it's off dry um it's dry i wasn't expecting that from the nose um i like it i don't 96 points like it i, I wouldn't go close to i said it's a 90 point wine i wouldn't go close to, to 96 points um, I like it for £25, and that's how much it costs from Lee and Sanderman. You can get it for $29 at K&L. And, &L. and um, yeah, I think it's, it's definitely worth a try at that price. Please do recommend me to try some wines. It's really fun to, to pick up things that I would never have uh, tried before. Um, please do. Leave it in the comments. Okay, bye!